Hi folks. Two years ago, January 6th, in the year of our Lord, 2020 AD, there was a riot at the U.S. Capitol. And as a result of this riot, a Capitol Hill police officer shot and killed one of the protesters, Ashley Babbitt. Now listen to Tucker Carlson briefly explain what happened and, and the result. Two years ago today, a Capitol Hill police officer called Michael Byrd shot an unarmed woman in the neck. At the time of that killing, Byrd had a documented history of gross negligence with a firearm. He left a loaded Glock pistol in a public men's room at the Capitol, which for a law enforcement official is a firing offense. But for some reason, Michael Byrd was still in the force that day. The woman he killed was called Ashley Babbitt. Babbitt was a married 14-year veteran of the U.S. military. She ran a pool cleaning company with her husband in San Diego. Physically, she was tiny. She was also unarmed. Michael Byrd later admitted he had no indication at all that Babbitt was carrying a weapon. She posed no visible threat. He killed her anyway. Under normal circumstances, Byrd would have been fired immediately and charged with murder, which he clearly committed. But that's not what happened. After doing essentially no investigation into the shooting, Nancy Pelosi's congressional police force declared Byrd a national hero, and the media strongly agreed. Byrd went on television to accept accolades and to complain about racism. He was never punished for killing Ashley Babbitt. He was rewarded for it. In August of this past year, Ashley Babbitt's mother is in Washington, D.C., and she's been there ever since, protesting, demanding further answers as to the murder of her daughter, resulting in which you will see that she was arrested. Ashley Babbitt's mother was arrested, not for rioting at the Capitol, but for jaywalking. That's why she was arrested, for jaywalking. So wait a minute. The man who murdered her daughter is a hero. The mother is arrested for jaywalking. I don't know anywhere in these here United States of America where anyone was arrested for jaywalking. But here's the part that's really upsetting. The person that took Ashley Babbitt's life is a hero. The person who gave Ashley Babbitt life is arrested for jaywalking. That's the United States of America in this 21st century. We're a doomed and a failed nation. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America, please. And God bless the nation you happen to be in. See ya. <laughs>